Hello friends, Archangel with Crypto Angel here. In this tutorial video, we will be looking at how to bridge bone tokens from the Ethereum mainnet to the Shibarium mainnet. So first, before we do anything, we want to make sure that we have the correct website address. And in this case, that website is shibarium.shib.io. Please make sure that you have that address correct and check it every time before you make an action as there are several scam sites out there and we want to make sure you stay as safe as possible. Next, we will connect our wallet. And for this tutorial, we will be utilizing MetaMask. So now we can see our wallet is connected to the site. We will be selecting from the menu up here. We will click the staking icon here and select bridge from the drop down menu. Now we can see that we are on the Ethereum mainnet and we have this option to switch to another network, which will be Shibarium eventually. And we are choosing to deposit bone tokens from the Ethereum mainnet to the Shibarium mainnet. So from this dropdown that says select token, we will select our bone token and we can see that we have a balance here. Once selected, we will choose for this tutorial 100 bone tokens to bridge over to the Shibarium mainnet. Now from here, we will click transfer and we can see what is and isn't possible. So if you wanted to delegate to a validator, that is a different process and another tutorial exists for that. So from this bridging, you cannot delegate or stake on the Shibarium network. You may do that on the Ethereum mainnet. So if you do want to delegate to a validator, please stay on the Ethereum mainnet. What is possible is moving funds from Ethereum to Shibarium. Here you can move funds from the Ethereum mainnet to Shibarium mainnet. This will take approximately 20 to 30 minutes for that transfer. From here, we will click continue. And as a note, if, if the uh, network is backed up, this could take up to several hours and this is not abnormal to any layer two. So once we click continue, we will see an approved deposit amount of $1.11. And please note that there are two transactions in the deposit process. So we will click continue. Now I do have revoke.cash installed to let me know what contracts I'm interacting with. So you may or may not have this pop up. For this one, I know I'm interacting with the Shibarium network and want to click continue. We will follow up with this transaction in our MetaMask account. And for the spending cap, we can use a couple things. We can either click default or we can click maximum. I would advise editing down. If you do use the maximum button, I would get a rounded number to whatever amount of tokens is in your MetaMask wallet for that transfer. So in this case, we'll go ahead and use, utilize the full 1557 for our custom spending cap from here. And this number can be anything you want below or above whatever amount you have in your wallet. So just understand that this is a spending cap and not necessarily the amount that will be transferred. From here, we will select next and our gas. We will click approve and we will see the continue button down here spinning. And now our approval has gone through, but we have not deposited yet. So this is important that there are two transactions so please do not close your screen or move away thinking that when you have submitted the approval transaction that you have actually deposited because you have not. So from here, we will click continue. Our estimated time is 20 to 30 minutes and we will see that this hundred bone comes back into the Shibarium main net. So once that transaction goes through, we should see 100 bone in our Shibarium balance. So from here, we will click continue and finish this transaction in our MetaMask account. And we will click confirm. 
and now the funds are being moved and we will eventually see a successful transaction pop up on the Ethereum mainnet. So the transfer is now in route. Your transfer is underway and will be completed in 22 to 30 minutes. Once completed, your token balance will be automatically updated. So we'll close that out here. And next time we come to this page, we will eventually see 100 bone tokens in the Shibarium amount and we'll be able to select withdrawal if we want to pull those out. Now, it is important to note that if you want to remove bone tokens from the Shibarium mainnet, it will take seven days to transfer that amount back to the Ethereum mainnet. This does not apply to any other token on the Shibarium mainnet. This seven day reflection will only apply to bone tokens. So if you want to transfer ETH or SHIB or Leash back and forth between the Shibarium mainnet and the Ethereum mainnet, you can do that at the normal time it takes to transfer with a bridge. So we can see that the withdrawal time from moving your funds from Shibarium to Ethereum normally takes up to 60 minutes to three hours of time. For every token besides Bone, this will be the case. For the Bone balance, that will take seven days to show up. And with that, we have transferred our Bone tokens from the Ethereum mainnet to the Shibarium mainnet. Now, one of the things to note is if we want to see our tokens in our MetaMask wallet, we can click the Ethereum mainnet button menu drop down and click switch network. From here, we will select the Shibarium button and this will allow the switch in our MetaMask account. So we will click switch network and now we are on the Shibarium mainnet. And to go back to the Ethereum mainnet is just as simple. We will click the, Shib the Ethereum mainnet and click switch network. So you can go back and forth between the two at your discretion. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. And with that, we'll wrap up this tutorial. Archangel out.